Had Suni Miku for 20. We got to watch the Eric fucking July video. Oh, uh, yeah, we, we have do. to watch Eric's it. Eric's video shows Riley slapping. Let me finish the Super Chats, then we'll go to the video. Eric's video shows Riley slapping Mitzel in the face to prove he is a dangerous criminal. Yeah, that famous slapping situation. Uh, we will watch the video. Euthanasia enthusiast for seven Canadian. FYI, there's more than one Canadian accent. Ontario's is gayest. Yeah, there's like the like uh, the trailer park boys. Yeah, Julian. We just did what we did to get by, eh? Right? Yeah. Yeah. Julian. And the Newfoundland, they're like, oh, yeah, fuck, right? Yeah. They're way fuck. They're like a uh, bunch of sheep fuckers out there. They fuck something weird. I would have to watch a lot more uh, sec. What is it? Trailer uh, Park Boys. Whatever that, uh, yeah. Whatever John Candy was on. Drunken Atheist Studio for two. It says Ice T liked a tweet I made the day Elon hid likes. Ah. And Cyphers and Suck This for 25 says so dangerous you better run anime girl. All I right. think we're going to watch July's. Eric July's commentary on that keyboard. Here you go. On the Riley situation. Guys, thanks for sticking with us. Don't forget to vote up all the problems at biggestproblem.show and subscribe to Patreon to get the bonus episode Biggest Problem in Prison, where we're not allowed to have Riley appear on the episode for some reason. Uh, although I don't even know if Riley wants to come on, so who cares? Is this it? No. That's the Alpha Core trailer. Oh, wait, it's Young Clippa. Yeah, you're on the yeah. Ripperverse uh, site. No, wait, wait, wait. Young Rippa. <laughs> Can't even remember his things. Young... Hey, that's confusion in the marketplace. Yeah, you're, like, <laughs> trying to convince Riley that he fucked up. It's... it's not that he fucked up. He just needs to make better arguments. <laughs> it's This is not... Whatever. So I've been instructed to... Oh, uh, oh. Okay. Here we go with a jibber-jabber. Everybody set your... Set your... Set your clocks for jibber. Hold on, let me let me and get ready. Do, do not fucking. What are you doing? Make it a square and establish out the square. What did that do? Will you shut nothing? The, shut the. You're fuck just changing the fucking size of this and that. That's I'm what I'm doing. It, I'm making it fit. It's the same ratio. It's not the same. Yes, ratio. it is. No, it's how is it not? It's this. It's shot in the same fucking ratio. Going back and forth doesn't change it at all. If I hit this, is it a... Uh... No. Oh. You ready? I am ready. You ready? So I've been instructed to give a public statement. That means that everything the public needs to know will be in this video. Thus, I'll have no further comments outside of this and anything else will need to be addressed with our legal team. You fucking liar. You always say this is the last comment you're making and you always make more comments, Eric. You stupid cocksucker. You look, look at the hippo look. Look at his tongue. I'm not going to make a comment about that. Are you not going to talk about anything in this video? Because I just won't play it. Play it. If you're not talking, I'm not going to play it. I'm not going to call him a hippo. If you're going to not, if you're going to do like your Casa do I have to, shit. Do I have to? If it's not something we're going to watch, if it's not something that's going to be funny, I'm not going to play it. Play the video. You may know by now that a crazed man was arrested outside of a recent Ripperverse meetup after trying to cause a scene, heckling guests, and attempting to interrupt the event. He was told by the venue to leave and stay off the property. The venue instructed him to leave, and he refused. So his conflict with the police was created out of his own actions, and the cop explicitly states why he was called. Why is he playing Kino Casino? He knows what he's doing. He Eric wants, knows all of these people. He wants everyone to go watch Kino Casino's coverage. Yeah. He want he wants to direct people to this Canadian re, these Canadian. Is this what retards. they look like? Yeah, dude. He looks. He like, looks like Paul Bearer. Yeah. PPP looks sick. Yeah, and Andy Worski rotted out half his nose with the cocaine. Like, what are you gonna do? I think that's cool. But look at this. I think that's cool. Look at this fat pig. Well, you know, Dick, you can't do, do. Well, you know, God wants you to be fat as possible, eh? <laughs> I was a preacher. Why do you put all the animals down if you're not supposed to eat them all? <laughs> the, the Jews casino. prayed for food, and God the gave it to casino. them, and you're supposed to eat all of it. Do we get a reaction from? Does he, did he play these guys because they have a reaction? Uh, what does he actually say that we're supposed to listen to? Uh, the cop explaining why he's there. Uh, the reason why I'm here is because I want to hear. As you can see, what? I can't even understand what he said. That's where a place where subtitles would help, Eric. Yeah.
I'm going to assume the cop said uh, something about causing a disturbance or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, great edit. Very good. See, it was not us that called the police, and I was unaware that this was even happening as I was enjoying the meetup inside with... Well, you did call the police before. Yeah. You did call them about a harassment thing. So some at some point, police were called. And your cross-eyed uh, goon stormed out, threatening Riley, and was clearly obsessed with him. Mm-hmm. Uh... Again, the re- I think the real haranguing the here's, owner to call the cops. Yeah, probably here's the thing. I think if somebody wants to call the cops and say uh, this is private property, we want Riley to move slightly. Okay, I can see the argument. Yeah, the real I problem. You can say that not on the blaze, not on the blaze. And there's a great argument to be made that why do you tolerate Alex Stein? You clap and you go, "That's great. I love that he bursts his way into things and he fucks around. That's yeah. awesome." Uh, I think there's a great argument to be made for hypocrisy, but I am so used to hypocrisy from these individuals that at this point I just go, none of these people actually believe the things they say. I know that in my heart of hearts. Yeah. The real problem, I would say, is that you got a warrant taken out on a man. Secret one. For taking a picture of himself in front of a Ross dress for less holding uh, several miles away. I don't even know where that fucking Ross is. Five miles away. Somebody, I know somebody lives there. Okay, five miles away, a man took a picture in front of a Ross dress for less holding a picture of giant novelty scissors. And that was one of the key bases for taking out a harassment warrant on that individual. Mm-hmm. And we, we can, of course, I think... And you knew that. And you knew it when you told him to and pull up. And you knew up. that. And uh, yeah, that's the other thing, is at no point did you communicate to this individual... I have contacted the police. There is a warrant for your arrest. Don't come. Don't come to my All event. All he said was, I'm going to shoot you if you show up well, again. I'm going to air you out. I'm going to air you out. So Eric July, I would imagine, knowing he must have known there was a warrant, they communicate that to you, right? If you were he's the one so who fucking ugly. harassment. Yeah, yeah, they do. Well, he's okay. clearly contacting them every week. So he knows, new shit. he knows there's a silly Billy warrant out there for the man's arrest. And uh, seems... Finds a way to concoct a situation where Riley, unaware, will be arrested. Yeah. With the fans. We now know that he was arrested because of an outstanding warrant. So Look at how he has that you caused. Did you see the, the clip he uses, though? Look, did you see Andy? Dearly beloveds. So I've been instructed to give a pub. One second. Did you see what clip he plays? Oh, what? Watch Andy Worski and PPP. Okay. This is the clip he chose. He was arrested because of an outstanding warrant. Are they laughing? Yes. That's how Uh, serious the situation was for his employees. So Eric's playing a clip of somebody laughing at it. He's going, I had to react for the safety of my employees. Get it? Right, right, right. Get it? Yeah. You guys get it? You see what I did? I fucking see what I did. You see what I did there? Guys, I told the cops. I hate him more than Maddox. He's easily. Maddox is such a joke. He's going, guys, I told them I was scared. Scared. And here's a clip of Andy laughing. And look, look, look at how funny it is. Look at how funny it is. Why else? He can get those clips. Kino Casino is not the only people who have those clips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He said, let me get these two guys laughing. It would actually be better if you zoomed in and cropped them out. Well, he wanted his audience to know, guys, I'm still a tough guy. I'm just abusing the law to get people arrested. Isn't that funny? Isn't that cute? Isn't that fun what I did there? This is the veto that I wanted. Well, it's expert-level yeah. commentary. Okay. He needlessly created a conflict with the police despite having this warrant for his arrest. That warrant Very is in relation situation. to stalking or harassment of me. This warrant was issued by the police department near our headquarters, and it wasn't due to a singular event. Mm. Thankfully for us... Yeah, it was, because everything else was tweets. It was due to one event, yes. and everything else was tweets. You giant bitch. You ugly, fatherless bitch with a fat wife. That's a lot going on. (laughs) This man documents most of what he does through social media posts, streaming, and recording himself. Our legal team has a mountain of receipts. That said, we think it's important for... Your legal team doesn't have receipts, you dumb... um, We saw the receipts. It's pictures of Riley in front of a Ross dress for less. Our legal team has a lot of... Uh, my superstar legal team has the receipts. 
We in, we the was hangs. We went to the moon on receipts. The police report he contains sets black, the phrase. Back, black people back like you know forty fifty. Sends them back to the times of Isomnox. For the public to understand the timeline and for some things timeline. to be cleared up. At no point have I had any discussion with this man. He does not appear to be a well-adjusted individual. He displays mental instability. He's violent and does not seem to be an honorable guy, considering he slaps an autistic woman on his stream. Oh. Eric July is a skillful liar. Uh, well, I don't know if he's a skillful liar or if he just- He's just black. Well, if he was white, nobody would be tolerating this shit. I think he black. he knows that his audience. A lot of these guys just know that their it doesn't matter what the truth is. They just say it because their audience is just waiting <laughs> to hear something. I think you know. You always criticize me. You go, Vito, why are you giving these guys any leeway? Whatever else, and I go. I just can't lie the way Eric July does. I can't do it. What do you mean giving them leeway? Well, you're saying you're like, well, why can't you just get on board? Or why are you saying blah, blah, blah? Or arguing with Riley about the copyright shit or whatever? And I yeah. go, because I just, I don't know. I think You don't have to argue with Riley about copyright shit when he's facing jail time. It sure. doesn't matter. Fair enough. And that's it's what I said. you're trying to show that you're I right. I said, well, I am right. I, yeah, you're not, though. I do know. You don't know. I know more about copyright and trademark. Where's your comic book, Riley. then? Well, you do not know more than Riley about that shit. I definitely do. <laughs> it's not important. Whatever. Refund super killer. Don't refund, refund super killer. Shut super the fuck killer. up. Look, the point is that I can't just lie the way this man lies. It's insane. You and Eric are the same guy. No. What you the really fuck? are. How? All that matters, no matter what, no matter what's happening, all that matters is that Being you right. guys are right. Is that you're right and that he's right. Okay. I'm Eric. Yeah, but miss, not black. I miss my dad. <laughs> He doesn't. You're right. He doesn't have that. He doesn't, he have, doesn't that. have that. You're right he about that. that. Well, right he has a that. little of that. I don't uh, know if he okay. knows him as well. And you were Nate's on her for pornography. Nice. These are all recent. Your fucking lore masters piss on each other for pornography, Eric. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Did you forget point. about that? You piss bearded fuck. <laughs> you ugly piece of shit. You fucking you dysgenic freak, the Eric. Sisters. Did you forget that you fucking hired twins that piss on each other? I haven't seen the video. I don't know exactly who's pissing on who, but there was piss. And then take pictures of kids that, in a rape that van? That also happened, yes. Did you forget that, Eric? I think if we're talking about piss, there's a lot of piss going around on all sides. You can't really use that as a lever against anyone. It's like his eyes are totally dead because his IQ is Wow, like, he looks mad right there. It's an, that's an unhappy He's so individual. mad. He's so fucking gay and pathetic. Well, Riley, of course, slapped his girlfriend. How can, can you believe it? Maybe I should go to a rip reverse event. He did a little three. He did like a little three stooges. Like, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna poke her eyes out. It's folks. Ob, It's like the most obvious. Dude, it's like, like wrestling shit. Yeah, it's kayfabe. Here he is beating an autistic woman. <laughs> Notice how short the clip had to be. That's how they always do it too. The two second clip. Because it can't go, oh, oh, okay, guys, I'm, I'm going to slap Mitt now. Bro, you are, oh. Eric, you are feeling up a woman who's looking at you like she wants to fuck your dick off on camera. How does that look? Yeah. You put out multiple videos where a white woman is, look, is where you're groping and caressing an employee I... who wants to fuck your dick off on camera, Eric. How about that? You know, that's uh, that's uh, for the courts to decide. Well, not for the courts. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> How about that? Nobody okay. wants that. For some Dude. reason, Nobody he made that. much of his social media presence about me. It started as an odd obsession with threatening to shave Because you're me. pathetic and you threaten to shoot everyone who makes fun of your gay comic. That's why. It's well, funny. the obsession started with, let's be clear, uh, two guys made fun of your comic book. Mm -hmm. You spurged out. You yeah. freaked out. You started sending people messages about how they need to be in your corner or you will reciprocate in kind. Yeah. Uh, and then everybody said, well, this is kind of goofy. Maybe there's other stuff I can say about this guy that will make him act goofy. And uh, they found a thing that can make you act goofy is uh, saying they're going to shave you. you went, which you, oh, which he, you told the he, cops. They can't shave me. They're going to shave me. And uh, they got the I'm reaction. I'm an athlete and handsome. I'm a handsome and ath and and. 
attractive athlete. So Eric Jolly, as a, I, I would say that guys of his type, you know, guys who posture as big, tough, no dads, uh, African American guys, yeah. that's okay, maybe right. part of it. Yeah, have not experienced the act of being trolled. It's mostly a white phenomenon. It's white guys, yeah, going at other white guys. As a yeah. black guy, he's never been on the internet. He's been like, confused wait, by wait, it. Wait, 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 wait. What is this? What, is it, you taking my picture? Are you, you taking mean? my soul? You gonna come to me and shave me? I can't, that cannot be allowed. And somebody in his corner, he hangs out with all white guys exclusively, and one black. Yeah. He has Brandon in his corner. One of them needed to go to that guy and go. <laughs> can't, 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 can't. Stop talking. It's just the internet. Alex Stein should have said, "Hey, man, they're uh, they're messing with you." you know? <laughs> You know what? I, Alex balls. Stein should have went through and said, "You know what I do? You see what I do? Imagine just this might sound crazy. Imagine they're doing that. Imagine to if you. you didn't eat breakfast today. Imagine if you didn't. But, uh, but I did eat breakfast today. <laughs> well, today. well, that's not what it is. But uh, what it is, I did eat breakfast on, on the hibbity day. What it is? Yeah. Well, me. As odd as that is, I wrote it off, but my security detail began to keep tabs. Just in case. Eric, you don't have a and security as... detail. What the fuck are you talking about? Well, it's his base. What are you, the Vatican? <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? If you look at the Rip Reverse employees. You don't even make very much money, like $2 million a year? No, no, no. Your company Dick, you isn't don't that understand. big. It'll be like Alex, head of production, publishing expert, security head expert. of security, it's like a, forklift operator. It's like a, a child making a movie on like an 8 millimeter, yeah. and then the credits. The credits like is just him and Catering everyone. mom. <laughs> Yeah, security detail. Well, catering this was Subway. Ginger fucking let's not, weirdo. Let's not lie about that. That went to fucking Thailand to get surgery. His security is just whoever is, you know, mixing My security his detail. latest album. They suspected it escalated beyond mere internet trolling. Let's get some facts straight. This old video has been dishonestly shared around to suggest that I've invited this individual. Not only is the context removed, it's over a year old. This means it predates me knowing of this person and it has nothing to do with them. You can tell it's old because there's no blood Ruth or Chadron posters in the background. Jesus ah. fucking Christ, you autistic, fr you fucking idiot. Well, that's how you know it's old. Otherwise there'd be a blood Ruth poster. See, you can see because my hit character Blood Ruth would have appeared behind me. It doesn't matter because I said pull up and fight me before he did, so it's irrelevant. Also, like I didn't say it after he came up and pulled up. I said it before, so therefore, by the transitive property of reverse chronology, well, he, yeah, he wants. He said I'm pull just up. Trying, I'm just trying to wrap my head around before this. he pulled up, Eric. When I've used the term pull up, I'm meaning to cordially discuss things. When I'm at a public event, now I've sure. clarified He's this over a, a year ago and slur. used the term much longer than that. At the shops at Legacy, I'll be there. Go ahead and pull up. You started using that. This you started doing after you threatened me and Riley to to fight you, and that went badly. I don't know. Then you started saying pull up because Nick time, said, yeah. "Well, you're saying pull up. That means fight." And then you're like. Yeah, so I, I went to the gas station, and I, I pulled up to the gas station. Mm -hmm. And my wife said, do you want a smoothie? And I said, pull up. That means get me a smoothie. Or perhaps my pants are falling again. And I said, pull up. Pull up. Pull up to pants. This dog, little dog, came up to me at the park, and I said, pull up, dog. I won't pet your ass. And one of the Saskas said, why are you not coming? And I said, pull, pull up. Pull up. Pull up. You're only doing down. He's such a piece of shit. It's not a good guy. And he's so... His arms are, like, pathetically skinny. All he had to do was go, that guy's a goof. Look at that goof. He wants this, though. He wants to get caught. He wants to get caught out as a fraud. Everyone who's protecting him doesn't realize that he wants to be caught as a fraud. Because he knows that he is. I think you can just stop watching this video the second he goes, he slaps his girlfriend. It's the same with the Maddox thing. The second he does the reverse graph, it's over. Yeah. It's, oh, so you're just making shit up. Making shit up. Cool. Yeah. Neat. I saw it saying pull up. Everyone says it. Oh, that's crazy. It's neat. Never heard of yeah, it well. like that before. Well, if you're in Texas, of course. Yeah. Common parlance. Pull up. If you, some of you, I mean, the RSVPs have already been laid, so go pull up to the booth. Chat with us. Buy some this items if that's what you I see, like, like, plenty, plenty yeah, merch. Listening to this man Pull infuriates up, me to the point where it's just like, I can't. cash it out, let's link up. Mm -hmm. So that can apply to people that love me. We say pull up. Obviously, that's not- Or what? what? That can apply to people that love me or what? 
So you did invite Riley, even with your lie of even with what pull up means, right? I'm just trying. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying. We got to get Riley money, I'm man. Just to get this individual. Riley's got to be able to fight this and sue him back. That'd be fucking I'm just great. To get, like it's just. You know, I you know I go nuts when people just lie, right? You know it drives yeah, me up a I know, fucking I know, wall. Because it it's just like, it's just blatant. It's just like, it doesn't even matter. The truth does not matter. Yeah. Riley slaps his girlfriend. Riley pisses on his girlfriend. That's and crazy therefore, that he would film himself staged in the middle of like a obvious staged environment slapping his girlfriend, right? It's, not a CCTV camera. Just like, hey, check this out. Okay, here's the donation. Slap. Oh, man. It's the same shit. It's it's all it's the same shit they do to Nick Ricada. It's the same shit they do to you. It's the same shit they do to me. Same shit they do to Trump. Yeah. Well, stealing the election, right? Absolutely. 100%. Just lies across the board. Yeah. But I did call Biden out for lying recently. Like there's oh. just everybody does it. What's <laughs> done? Okay. What they have done is crossed into territory that is unacceptable. To try to Fuck have off, their actions Eric. justify the man publicly has not told the truth about events. Okay. That hat told logo it. that you all Ella. see is the Ripper versus logo. It's ours. This person attempted to, and still does, try to sell that online. It is not a parody as we're not talking about the text. We are talking about the actual hat logo. They tried to sell that completely. Look at the fucking autism on display right now. Bro, you, you called the cops for months. Reporting Riley's uh, tweets, making fun of you, and you're autistically freaking out about his store that you DMCA'd over nothing. It's the over absolutely nothing. If somebody started selling like bootleg Dick and Vito, Koof has already done fuck. it. Koof yeah. prints shit out with All the logo the already. Well, let's say somebody was doing it to fuck with us. Who cares? I think we'd go. Yeah, what are you gonna do? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna waste time issuing a DMCA. No one's gonna buy this shit anyway. You obviously did it to fuck with him because he was making fun of you. Well, we know obviously. that. We know that's why he did it because he also false struck a bunch of other people for Vicky. making fun of his comic. The Vicky strike was 100% illegitimate. You can't say Frog Tony. Yeah, you can't say. Oh, you're not allowed to make fun of my comic because you might have pirated it, which I can't actually prove. Yeah, and even if I could, prove it, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Did it and Teespring, now known as Spring, busted them for autism. Teespring, well now now they're known as Spring. All right. Copycat. They did not obtain our warehouse address. Is it copy this infringement? Affair. Copyright Instead, infringement, they Eric, or our trademark is copycat. A completely unrelated thing. It was not from a DMCA of their own. Since then, this person went online and publicly stated multiple times that they'd be coming to Texas. They live several states away. We've documented them claiming Bro, he crossed state illegal. lines. It's not illegal. He, can't, he said he was coming to Texas. It wouldn't he, matter if he also lived in Texas. That's irrelevant. But I mean, he. But he's coming from a he far away distance. around the world. Yeah, like, uh, he's you coming know, from India. I'm is the East India to... Trading Company coming to take my salt? State lines. What a fucking freak. State lines. What a piece of shit. But he needs all this. He need because there's no substance here. He needs to build. It's always death by a thousand cuts. But we used to be death by a thousand cuts. At least the cuts were like semi interesting and relevant. This is what SJWs do. It's never one thing. It's never a bunch of things. This yeah. guy raped a girl. This guy punched a guy. Whatever. It's he set up a, a, on an Discord. He, where, said, and then he this. said this. And then also, and I remember cross state lines to get here. There was a guy they did this against, and like the evidence when you look at it was like he talked. To about having a Pornhub account, and that could mean that yeah. he's a sex, you know, that yeah, yeah, establishes yeah. a pattern of being a sexual deviant. Yeah. And I have to protect my employees, who you can see in this video are aggressively charging Riley. Let's try to get through this. this. Even in other people's streams, and telling people that they be going to my personal home. The they, uh, sorry, they will be going, not they be going, Eric. Mm. It's they will be going. To my home, not they be going to my personal home. You sound like a fucking idiot when you say it wrong. I don't know if we need to. <laughs> we know that. It's not new. No, 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 no. <laughs> we know that's it's all that matters. <laughs> Eric's illiteracy is all that matters. I know. Everything else he says can be written off because he is illiterate. I know. I wish that's the only thing we had to talk about.
That's all that matters. It's, that's all that's that matters to people listening. So funny. That's why the comic's so funny. The, the, he said it would be to come at my it is personal what it home. Is. It is. Is what it, was, it is. Is what it is. He is. He said he would come to my home. That's the sentence. Mm. I especially got crossed when they threatened one of my employees on video shortly after spring disallowed the sale of our logo. And still, I didn't where's think the that they would do something the clip? insane. The this clip? person drove Wait, all the, the way clip? to Texas. Where's the clip? Hold on, business hold logo. on, whoa, whoa, hold whoa, whoa, whoa. on. Threatened one of my employees? Threatened one of my employees you on mean, Alex, stream. you're bassist? Or, cro or fucking laser eyes? Why, if your security detail has been meticulously collecting evidence against this what individual? What happened to that? Okay, if you had a clip of him saying he's going to assault you, well, that would be very How come damning. there's only two Kino, uh, Kino Casino clips? In yeah, this? how come the only clips you have is a, a very zoomed-in shot? That's the other thing. It's not from far away to show how stupid the slap is. It's, oh, look, I zoomed in on it. This is the same shit he did to us, by the way, when he fucking threatened the lawsuit against us. It was like the most ridiculous, like, out-of-context clip. We got to hire a private investigator. To get to the bottom mm. of him fucking the Sasuke sister. Okay. You know? Yeah. You got to keep tab. I got to, within First Amendment rights. I know the guy. I know the guy. You know the guy? Yep. We got to do this. Salvage PI. <laughs> I'm calling him up. Salvage? Salvage. Salvage. The salvage? I don't know. The salvage. The savage. I think it is the salvage. He does good work. He does good work. He's got his ear to the Patient, ground. Which has several employees working there, of course. They would drive near the front of the building and then turn near around the during the day. Near the and front. then they came back at night, stuck things on the window. Things. And what, th what things? I can't do this, Vito, man. they did a U-turn? I can't do this, They did man. a U-turn in the parking lot. How? I can't do this. He stuck things? Things. To it the could building? could have been C4? Yeah, it could, could have been, been a Claymore. could have been it could the have proximity been a gay months. disease. I... Uh, can you imagine being Alex Stein and having to sit through this and not make fun of it? It's like, no, you have to cut promos because Glenn Beck told you. You have to cut promos with Eric. Bro. Stuck things. That's like hell. That would be like living this in hell. This is hell. This is hell for me. Yeah, but imagine you couldn't say anything Just about a man it. lying through his fucking teeth for eight minutes. They came back in the dead of night. But he's not going to say anything more about it. stuck things to my warehouse. What were they, and bunny? turn around during the day, and then they came back employees working there. Yeah, they're okay. autistic. They got lost. They would drive near the front of the building. Near the front. Near. Near the front. They drive near the, they drive near the front of the drive building. near the front. And then turn around during the day. And they turn around they during turn the around day? They turn around during the day. Oh, man. We're dealing with some real... Who writes this shit for him? They drove near the front of the building. And turned around during the day. Eric's got like uh, the the uh, always sunny lawyer that, you know. with the hands that writes this for him. It's good stuff. And then they came back at night, stuck things on the window, and took it to social you media, money? telling everybody that they do more. So money. you can understand after that. Do more money. Do more. Yeah, they put twenty dollars bills on the window. We're gonna do more. We're gonna do more, Eric. We're gonna give you a hundred next time. Eighty dollars. Insidious. That. Security got in contact with the police, and since then, you this did. person has continued the to levy threats did. on the internet, doxed my house. No, they didn't dox your house. Actually, Riley posted a, a picture of a house, but he doesn't say it's yours, and he doesn't have the address. He posts an MLS picture of a house that now we know is yours. Otherwise, it's just a house. Pictures of houses. He gives no big indication that thing for some reason. <sighs> big, big deal, big stuff. Look at Eric scribbled all this out in teal all by himself. He did a good job. I'm surprised he doesn't have the Kino Casino. You know, you can you can walk by a, a house and just look at it. They sell maps to Hollywood houses. Do you know they've in L.A. I, you know that they sell maps to your house. I have had. They're doing live doxing. I've had. Isn't that amazing? People have posted pictures of my apartment, and uh, at no point did I go, "Oh my fucking god!" I gotta call the police. I gotta get. I, gotta, I went. Yep, that's my building. And bragged about going to my ancestor's grave to deface it. Since growing my well, you told him that he 
you accused people of pissing on Isom's grave. So he made a joke. So he said, yeah, I pissed on his grave. You saw my great tweet where I said, I put Isom's gravestone up my ass. I saw that. Because it's on the same level of stupidity as... Yeah. You guys Why don't you put that in the video? First. He went to my ancestor's grave and claimed that he to shoved put the it gravestone up his up his Now, what kind of man would put a gravestone like that? Do you understand that it's? Look at the hippo teeth, man. Yeah. It's just like every part of him is repulsive. It makes me want to throw up. He's got a cool hat. Ugh. My company, I've welcomed many people into the fold. This is much bigger than myself, and I am responsible for maintaining a safe work environment. I know, you're dead. I have dad. employees and thus their families that depend I know. on it. When I know. Eric, you're not, no one's family depends on you. Your company sucks. I don't know what he's paying those people. It's too Look, much. You're making two million bucks a year? That's nothing, yeah. man. For a warehouse and, and five employees, I employees. have employees. I have people I pay to work on my things. And you made a video talking about how I made a lot, how I started a copyright trademark claim against you. Did you ever at any point say, well, this might affect Vito's ability to amass income and pay his people? How could I possibly do that? That would be a. Uh, this horrifying. video is way more upsetting than Riley's arrest. I know. I don't know why you're like, oh, this is a, this is a comedy show. We do a comedy. This is infuriating. Someone displays this type of behavior. You must report it. Okay. Because if you don't, oh. and something happens, you're going to be the one held liable. Even if this was a random person that did this, our security team would still have us contact. If a random person got novelty scissors and... Right, Eric July, down, yeah. Eric July says shoulders. everyone should report Alex Stein to the cops. That's what he just said. I I can't. Who knows? Alex, who know, I can't believe Alex. Who Stein knows what Alex Stein might this. do? Alex Stein might come back with a gun and kill everybody at that protest. So everybody right now, Eric July is directly instructing you: if you see Alex Stein at an event, call the cops. Call the cops. You it's owe the it to only, your employees. You owe it to your employees. You reason. don't know what might happen, and it yeah. is your job to take an internet comedian and throw him in jail. That's what he's saying. He's saying, throw my fellow Blaze employee in jail because you don't know what Alex Stein is capable Man, of. Man, it's crazy that how, it's crazy how much shit you you have gotten over the years, and this is worse than all of it combined a hundred times. It doesn't matter. All these people are liars. None of and them hypocrites. will say anything. It's like I said, I am surrounded on all sides by ah. evil and darkness, oh, and yeah, I'm not yeah, yeah, yeah. joking. Here's your null post. I, I'm the in this moment, <laughs> am enlightened. You gotta be funnier, though. The police, the considering the great lengths this person went through and their mental instability, we can't afford to take this lightly. Instability. We live in reality, not wishful reality. standards. If someone what? were to get hurt, political posturing won't help us. You're right. Alex Stein I might help people. I had to have a long conversation with our employees because many of them were creeped out, as you can imagine. Alex Stein they creeps a lot of people out. They deserve to have and should not feel You're right. unsafe. We have to stop Alex Stein. Nobody felt unsafe, you lying cocksucker. You admitted on a stream, Brent, I think. Your fucking uh, cross-eyed, laser-eye homeboy Pulled is talking up. about he's going to fight him. Alex, that ginger, ginger loser, is constantly fucking with Riley. Let's make this exact video and just go, Alex Stein has done this, this, and this. Yeah. You can I just make this a to. I had to report him to the he police. He called me a big booty Latina. He brought Don Terrius into my office of place, and Don Terrius was going wild. So Money, man. It's not worth it. Hypocrisy. Yeah. All Form the authorities that I can handle myself, and I always like my odds, but I'm no fool. I will treat threats accordingly and fear for my employees more Alex than myself. Alex Stein's a scary guy, you're right. Nobody is going after your employees, bro. Or was unprepared simply because he didn't take it seriously or he thought that he was some sort of macho man. And yep. we've seen their actions. No one thinks this you're a macho man, is not you dancing twink. We gotta stop no. Alex Stein. Ooh, ooh, wow, look at that macho man that he's doing. Hold any benefit of the doubt. Even if we didn't know who this guy was, if a random guy did this, we do our due diligence. If you do not have employees, dozens of employees, and a business to protect, I don't anticipate that you will understand the importance of due diligence. You gotta protect I'm not risking employees. my business, my life, or the lives of those around me. Eric, I'm your done. business I'm is done. your Stop business it. is over. It's the biz your biz <sighs> Eric's business died when he stopped responding to me. Yeah. Your business was 
you arguing with people online. Monetizing the haters. When you stopped responding to me, the business died. Now you died. hang out with a British guy who pretends to laugh at all your jokes and like all your comics. Yeah. There is no more <laughs> Ripaverse. The Ripaverse died when you said, I'm not mentioning Dick by name, even though everyone knows I'm talking about him. Even though I'm obviously talking about him in every post. I'm not dealing really with him anymore. You really wanted that two million. That was the end. You really wanted that two million for Yaira. Not even close. Well. Especially not for those that have already applauded efforts to have the state weaponized against me. I have no and idea what that means. To ruin my business. So let me make this over, bro. That's, that's the Ripaverse what does he mean? All respectable. What does he mean? Have a what it applauded the state's attempt to destroy my business? He says we're the celebrating. Church lawsuit. I, I don't know. That's not the state. That's a, a church. Yeah. But you said we're fake Christians. How has the state tried to do anything to you? What do you mean? <laughs> his taxes? Is he paying taxes? Maybe taxes. Maybe, maybe asking him about his taxes, if he's paying them. You got to pay taxes, Eric. I don't know. Is he paying taxes? I don't know. I would I would hope. OSHA? You get OSHA involved? I don't Who's know. applauding the state? I don't fucking know people in agreement or disagreement oh, yeah. we appear at cons and have our meetups okay. as long as you are respectable so you more than likely will get the chance to talk to me in person about anything you want RSVP how about talk about how loose your wife's pussy is the other hey, guests. I, oh respectfully hi i'm a big fan uh i just want to know respectfully how loose is your wife's pussy is it dark purple or is it like a raspberry what are you What are you talking about? Respectfully, respectfully, obviously, respectfully. I don't, you know, I have deep respect you for fucking, what you're doing here. Yeah, I love, I love it. But how loose is it? How big are you? This man right? slaps big his enough? girlfriend and pees on her. Right, right. So I can do and say I whatever, whatever I want. Whatever I want. Him. I can do anything. Yeah. Anything. Anything's on the table. Yeah, anything's on the table. Did you see how fat Nerdrotic's wife is? She looks <laughs> fucking disgusting. Look, if we get on that, she we're looks gonna like go a for a, fu- for a bro, year. She looks like a fucking monster. For him to make that much money and her to be that <laughs> vile is a fucking now, the travesty. Ozymp- the Ozempic revolution is coming, so well, everybody's going to They're going to need something stronger than that for her. Well, she looks like a fucking pig. Him oh. and hers. If you really wanted to speak with me, and he it's doesn't not just speak simply trying to put on a show for internet engagement, you actually want to talk to me. Yeah, It's a I very do. easy thing to do. Okay. If you want How? to be critical of me... Go right ahead. Okay. Yeah. Stay on the internet and troll. Make as many videos oh. as you like. Okay. But do not appear at my house. Do not dox me, or those around me, those close to me. Well, stay and on the do internet. Do not threaten my employees. It's okay. Stay on the internet or don't dox you. Okay. And don't threaten your employees. Okay. But what else? Why is Alex Stein allowed to go to businesses? What? What is this? Alex Stein can go. If he made this you video, remember Alex Stein when he was on like Conspiracy Castle? Yeah, I loved it. What do you said looking at this? He said this guy's a goo. I this guy's like if you watch if pathetic. you watch Alex Stein, okay, you can tell his heart's breaking. You can tell he's like he loves. I remember when I, I was he like, was like, doesn't he like to believe in God? Alex Stein? Yeah, I don't know. Probably does he? I don't know. Man. All I know is I remember when I was like, hey, you know, when he was first starting off, I'm like, hey, you should go on the Dick Show. You should go on with Ethan Rowley. He's like, oh my god, I love those he's guys. Great. He's yeah, fucking great. Love, he loves all this shit, and he's like, I wish I could still hang out with those guys. Those guys are fun. Well, you can do whatever you want. Well, not not if you want to, uh, Glenn Beck to pay your. Alex Stein didn't get the Glenn Young Beck Entrepreneur Award. Glenn Beck is not going to pick this token over Alex Stein. I think. Uh, hmm. Alex Stein should just do a show and just call Eric July. The Alex N-word. said there's a lot of uh, people at the Blaze who don't like what he's uh, who? bringing to the table. Probably old fuddy duddy conservative like who, what guys. Who's bringing to the table? What Alex Stein's doing? Oh, uh, that sucks. I think there's a lot of like old conservative guys who go, "Can't you just uh, you know, just do what do, Eric does? Do what the, Eric call does the cops. and talk about how much you love Israel and that sort of thing." Hard to imagine that all of this is over comic books, though a lot of untrue things have been stated. Even if we took their word for it. It's not over comic it, books. It's, it's over you not having a dad. Like 3D assets, Teespring stores with negligible sales, or not liking a comic book. It's not worth getting so riled up that you harass others and risk going to jail or prison. Oh. Be easy, y'all. 
and God bless. I'm going to make the argument that making comedy has such value that it is absolutely worth, worth going to jail for. Going to jail yeah, for. Yeah, absolutely. Riley is attempting to create comedy. In the same way, you could say to Alex Stein, why would you interfere with this brave trans uh, drag time story hour? Why would you cause trouble at a uh, city council meeting? Because it's funny. If you're making art it's and messy. you don't think it's worth going to jail over, you art shit. You're not making art. Yeah. It's dog shit. What it comes down to is, is it kind of funny? Is it funny what he's doing? Then I'm, I'm sorry to say that, <sighs> yes, it's not just about comic books. It's about comedy. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. And boy. you got involved. Eric, you got involved with a bunch of comedians. You said, these two comedians are making fun Call of my N-word. comic book. I'm going to monetize these haters. And you know what? I'm going to say that guy is a bit of a Buster Baxter. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you were not you were not playing the right game, my friend. And now you're going, I don't understand why these comedians are. Can you believe this about comic <laughs> books? And then he's like, comic books are the future. We got to destroy Disney yeah, and Marvel. He, he, we will win. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Remember to like and subscribe.